Hello. Let's meet Mindy, a second grade teacher, and see how her class celebrated more than one and a half years of math growth with happy numbers. In short, Mindy's success pathway looked like this. Mindy set up her class, and the student's math adventure on happy numbers started with a placement test. Then Mindy evaluated the test results and introduced to students their individual weekly targets. Mindy continued with her weekly routine, tracking student time and task targets and making sure students were on track. Mindy was glad that she could set up happy numbers with just a few clicks. That's because it's compatible with Clever or ClassLink. It's also easy to set up with your school email address. You just need to enter your email, your first name, and create a password. Select your role as a teacher and start creating your class. Adding students is also a really simple process. Your class is ready to go. The first time Mindy's students logged in, they were automatically given a placement test. This adaptive test consists of 20 questions and is powered by Metametrics, the masterminds behind the Lexile framework for reading. It determines each student's level to create a starting point for their individual learning pathway. Based on the test results, Happy Numbers Technology distributed Mindy's students into four categories of grade level readiness. Mindy wanted to make sure that her students would be ready for third grade. She introduced weekly targets to her students. The weekly time target is a minimum number of minutes students are recommended to practice per week. By default, it is set to 45 minutes. The weekly task target is the number of tasks students are expected to complete each week. It's updated weekly and set automatically based on the student's time target and current assignment. Hitting their weekly targets moved the students closer to their math growth goals. As they used happy numbers as part of their regular math routine, these targets became the building blocks for future success. As students solved tasks with happy numbers, they could see their progress toward weekly targets. Meanwhile, Mindy monitored each student's performance from her easy-to-use teacher dashboard. It put weekly progress, time spent, accuracy, and topic of study at her fingertips. Mindy knew exactly when and where students struggled, so she could intervene. Over time, Mindy took advantage of her teacher dashboard to see how much her class was advancing into the curriculum. She could see the curriculum progress her students made so far. In January, Mindy launched the Mid-Year Assessment to measure student growth. Based on the assessment results, Happy Numbers adjusted students' individual learning pathways to focus on the skills they needed most. Mindy knows the value of effective communication with colleagues and parents. She used Happy Numbers downloadable reports to share student data, easing communication and involving parents in the learning process. Mindy shared her class progress report with her school principal monthly and at the end of the school year. Together, they recognized her students' math success. Throughout the school year, detailed student reports informed Mindy's communication, especially on report cards and at parent conferences. She was able to discuss student progress with parents and make the whole process clear for them. The recipe for Mindy and her students' success was regular use, target completion, and consistent monitoring. And Happy Numbers was with them every step of the way.